biggest reload in the coldness in the uh in the west north south antarctic arctic we'll go with that hey guys pendeth here and today i'm gonna be trying out arctica on the oculus cv1 now the only thing i know about this game is it's made by the same people who made the metro series and that this is a post-apocalyptic style game where it's like looks like there's like robots and stuff like it's a little bit in the future and it's cold because you know arctica so yeah <laughs> so other than that and being a first person shooter i have no idea what this game is about i remember getting this game solely because of the way it looked and the fact that it was made by the metro series so it was a developer who had really phone really snapchat uh had previous game development history yeah <laughs> looks like it'll be fun looks a lot, the screenshots look really good so yeah without further ado i hope you guys enjoy well, Profile 6 didn't get anywhere, but just in case, because I've had crap luck, I'll go with an empty one to start from scratch. I haven't gotten anywhere. The only thing I've done is try to load up the game. That's it. Either OBS wouldn't want to listen, or the audio wouldn't want to work. Holy crap. Region. Vostok. Colony. Arctica. One. Welcome to Vostok. I hope you like it cold. Kinda. I don't- I'm Victoria. Hi. I know you were briefed when you accepted I, the contract. I don't know where you want me to stand because I'm it's like. it my experience that Citadel always seems to forget something or other. Yep. This is my life now. You can see we have lots of security out here at the approach and surrounding Jeez. the civilian colony, but you won't be operating in there. Well then. Okay. That's a little turret. Uh, yeah. Citadel I... sent you to protect the travel hub, and you'll be doing most of it by yourself. I don't- I don't have a seat. Like, I got this seat, but like, I, I'm just okay. blacked out everywhere that isn't Thanks. standing. Hi, bye. There are good people here. Are they? Because, uh... For you, this is a job. For us, it is hope of another chance. I thought I was gonna say way of Not life. everyone from Cipada remembers that. Yep. There used to be a major city here. Even a university. Oh, wait. After the Great Freeze, though, those who could leave, did. Those who couldn't, congregated at Arctica 1. A wall was built to protect them, but the uh, old travel hub was pretty useless and wasn't enclosed. Wow, that's actually a lot better subtitle. Later, though, it was put to good use processing deuterium, so the dust yeah. people like you to protect it. Trust me, you won't get bored. Well, that's weird. I don't- f I feel violated with that scan. Hello, newbie. Hot. Hope you don't end up as Yaga food. I'm a Victoria. You staying warm? Haha, ha, very funny. Hi. Give Hi. Me pass card, will you? There's no seat here yeah, either, so I. Yeah. Got to follow protocol. Yeah, protocol. Very important protocol In the is. Box. Right oh. there. So I am supposed to be here. Where the hell's my seat at? And why are you? Why is this TV active? The card should be in there. Yeah, but that's out of my sensor range. Ah. There you go, sir. You are cleared. What Thank you, a sir. surprise. Was it, though? Was it really? You'll mainly be up against groups of bandits. If it was a surprise, where's the cake? Most of them are soldiers of fortune, but... I said we have good people here, and we do, but some turn deadly. These, we exile. Oh. We have families, children to protect. Of course. Most exiles don't survive, but a few join the bandits. My point is, you can't hesitate, or you'll be dead. Oh, I can hesitate. I'm fine with hesitation. Misha mentioned your other concern. Yagas. In the early days, food was scarce. Thousands starved to death. Many survivors were so hungry, they consumed the dead. Uh. Yeah? Really? See those red icicles? Uh, Mutated yes. Mutated algae in the ice due to a misguided attempt to stop global warming. Well then. Something similar turned the Yagas from people desperate for food into... Well, you'll see. Oh, thanks. Appreciate it. We call them Yagas after Baba Yaga. 
famous witch in our folklore. She was ugly and powerful, and known for eating children. Well, I'm an adult, so I think I'm pretty safe. The bandits are after the deuterium. The Yagas, they're only after you. Oh, Shoot cool. Shoot them on sight. I'm you not a child, though. Favor. Only mentally. Does that count? Am I safe from being, like, a mental child? Can I, uh... Yeah? No? Shit. Looks, this game looks pretty, though. Look oh. over to your left. Those two I... are to go after the Yagas. Oh. It's very hard to see, plus I'm fogging up. But the snow, wow, they look like gorillas. That's the gate up ahead. Robotic gorillas? Yeah? Oh, cool. What the hell was all that for, then? There's a lot of security. Right. That's the transport hub. You can still see some of the old airplanes. Oh, yeah. Were those landed or crashed? Just, uh, I feel like I, that should be a known question. Or a, a common question, and a very easy one to answer. I like the signs. This looks really cool. It's futuristic and cold. I've never ga played a game with both. The supply vehicle is going to add to go on. There it is, over on your left. We're heading for what was once the air control tower and is now the main base of Tsubada operations. Okay. Like I said, you'll be providing most of the hub's main security, but the robots will be able to help. Okay. And we've well, got state-of-the-art equipment for you to use. Yay! Well, I would like By a pot. This is your transport. You'll need it to get to some of the more distant places in the hub. Are you my driver? Most of the time, you're going to move short distances in quite a different fashion. Well. Damn. I just want to try to redo my headset because I'm way too close to the, my border. I got all that room, but it's like, no, here's the... F here, say hi to your computer for you. It's always fun to see how the teleport works. Go over to the breaker switch. Okay. No! I didn't hit nothing! Reset view. Look forward and press A button. But, uh, is that not the A button? A button. The breaker switch is over there. Seriously? Uh, look and press. Give it a shot. Now pull the lever and let's get the Wait, power what? going. But uh, sure. Okay. See, last time I was loaded, first time I loaded up, I think it said something about I had the option to move to. Oops. You'll get. Hi. There are three levels in the control tower. Okay. The garage, the armory, and the control center at the top. We'll You're stop tall. at the armory first. Way to make me feel short. Here we are. Oh, cool. Fancy. Um, I come keep hitting that button. Okay. I thought These there was a way to move, but. First set of weapons that Citadel has authorized for you to use. Oh, cool. You'll get new weapons and upgrades as you fulfill your contracts. Well. These then. guns load a bit differently from those you're used to. They're equipped with magnetic auto-loading capabilities. To load this one, drop your hands down to your hips, like this. Pick it up. Seems simple enough. I like the little force field. You could have just reached around it or something, but we're wasting time. Come on. No. So Fire so I can't shoot you. Get a feel for it. Remember, just drop your hands. Down. Drop your hands down with a snap. It's just insta fail. Damn it! Great. What bam? Bam. I'm down and I'll show you how to reload the second one. Okay. I'm kind of foggy still, so it's kind of difficult, but this second one auto loads when you snap the barrel to the left and Let's back, see. like this. Oh. Give it a try. No. Set. Okay. Give me the big beast, yeah! Fire at the targets. Ooh, yeah. I cannot shoot left-handed. He's got no head. They they don't have heads. I'm sorry, I broke it. Now this feels powerful. He's jumping out. Oh, too soon. The 
beast on this one. <laughs> he matrixed me. The holsters are magnetized. Once the weapon has been paired with them, the guns will always be in there. It's very useful. Just raise your arms, bend your elbows, bringing your hands over your shoulders. Then let go. They'll slip right in. The magnets get close. That lets you know you're in the right spot. I like it! I think you're ready for a training simulation now. Pick up the VR headset and put it on. Alright, that's tripping me out. Hey, that looks familiar. Except for the headset pieces. Why do you- Why won't it let me back up? I got all this room! I have all this room back here! And it's like, no! Stay up right here! vr reception. This is a chance to practice teleportation. Oh god, double the fog! Alright, mission one. Kill all enemies using skills learned. Introduction, cover, and basic combat. Reward 25,000 credit points. Alright, so, do I have free teleportation, or is this just gonna be a... I don't think that was supposed to happen. Excuse me! Oh. Okay. It's really good. Okay. Reload P! How am I not shooting you in the face? What the f Weird. Pick it. Pick it. Rude, man. This yeah. This point will not protect you well, but it offers a good aggressive close range strategy. The system will always show them in yellow. Head to the next room, and we'll see how you perform. Okay. Oh, I was wondering where that was coming from. Can I auto move? This was weird being limited to so much movement. Well done. Let's move on. There's more I need to show you. Go ahead and remove the headset. This is pretty cool. Come on. I'll yeah. show you to the control room in your quarters. Okay. God, you make me feel like a God, baby, I am a child. With how tall you are, I feel like it. I'm not really that tall. That hologram is not me. We're heading to the top of the control tower. We're protected here on this side of the wall. Can you, like, let me just hop up here? You'll be taking your transport vehicle over to the hub once you're ready to get to work. Okay. We have coffee, rations, music, books. Not that you'll have a lot of downtime. That ass, though. I work over there, <laughs> and I never sleep. Well, I apologize for that. Your missions will be listed on this nap. God damn, you make you me feel short. You and I constant communication. Connected here, okay. on the desk. I did it. Shit. Okay, listen up. You need to clear the bandits from the subway terminal. Ooh, Keep an eye out for anything else that might be living down there. But be careful not to cross paths with the sentry robot. It's gone rogue, and I'm not sure what it will do if it sees you. Oh, that's pleasant. No EMP? Man, I want to take a nap. It's nice with the windows on. Start up your nap, come and get ready. Ooh. Uh, I'm gonna try one more time to- my station here, keeping this place from falling apart. Well, at least As I got- usual. At least I have company. I'm not in my office by myself. I'm like, you know, it's my first day and all. Let me try to reset view from back here. Finally! Jeez! 
Couldn't have done that earlier. I'm there? No, I'm over here. That's more, that's better. Oh, yep, okay. Where am I? Metro. Uh, boop, boop, yes, tap. Mission one, robot go grog, and boop. Oh, shit, I gotta stop hitting that button. I'm still not used to the Oculus. First time using Oculus, I think, since I've uh, set up my computer to Windows 10. It was really th weird to think about when I went to set it up. I went to try Vive during the weekend, or the Oculus during the weekend, and oh, wow, I didn't realize those were transparent. I was too busy getting distracted and feeling short from the lady. Um, I don't remember her name. Did she say her name? That's weird. Um, but yeah, I went to, and I was like, Vive isn't working, whatever. Let me get on the Oculus, and it was like, set up for your rift. And I was like, all right, I haven't touched it since. But yeah, the, she made me feel short and like a child, so maybe I am going to be eaten by the whatchamacallits. This episode's going to be a little bit longer because of the whole uh, intro. I knew this was going to be more of a get full game, though. But uh, it was apocalyptic and made by uh, the Metro people. So I was like, I want to give this a shot. Triple A title VR game. Hell to the yeah! I just got to pray that everything goes well. You're there. It's Let's start. Okay. Remember, Ooh, try to disable the robot so we can fix him. But it may be easier to just destroy it. Okay. Be on the lookout for bandits or other unwelcome visitors, too. Will do. These are some nice right. cars. Get moving. Okay, well. Oh, so. God, it, it throws me off when I breathe and actually see the uh, smoke. The, the, yeah, the, fr the breath. Oh, that's a fancy ass car. Does it just know when I'm breathing? Because that's weird. How do I open hood? Is it not a button? I'm trying. Oh. Yo, where's your. Is your head there? I can't tell. I'm just gonna set that back down. Uh, yeah, right there. That's where I wanna be. Oh, okay. Well, it's the trunk, not the hood. Alright, who we got here? Deep Ocean Retro. Oh, we got some good music here. Uh, move record to your... Oh. oh, I didn't know that was actually important. I mean, it was the only thing that I looked like I could pick up, but... Why would I holster it? That is a very bright gun, just throwing that out there. Put your weapons away in order to open the door. Oh, they're away. Use your magnetic holsters. Now, pull that lever. You there! Tubular, bro! Sorry. Look out. Bandits. Yeah? You don't say. They don't see me yet, though. See him! Hi! He's behind that car! No, I'm not! I'm not left-handed! I'm assuming I'm assuming that's orange because it's not the safest move. No fair, he's got a hood. Can I blow that up? Is that a thing I can do? I have destroyed the shit out of that. Ooh. Well that's not distracting. Can you get out of the way? this. Yeah? You done? You bunch of dicks? Oh. Oh, that went all around your head. Yeah. 
I had a feeling. Surprise, mofo! You thought I was over this still. Oh. Oh. Yeah. You didn't give me a grenade or anything? Peek it. Let's go. Not bad for your first time. Looks like this room is clear. They say. I may be due to the game, but this ain't my first rodeo. Hey, these are the same elevators as we got. Yeah. Now's a good time to check your weapons. Stay alert. Oh. Okay. I didn't see you up there. I totally murdered that guy from over there. That was the probably coolest VR kill I've ever gotten. God, I can't shoot. You think you want some of me? What's up? Let's go! What up? Crank it! Crank it! Yeah! You're blue, so you're, fr you're safe. Right? Snipers! Be careful when you see their lasers. Enjoy. Hi! That was awkward. Didn't give me a grenade, huh? Shoot that fuck up. This is my best shot, I think. No, I'm not. Dude, you just got popped straight in the face. Yeah, it does. It's about to hurt a lot more. They're turning out in bigger numbers than usual, and that bothers me. Well, it bothers me too. We have an important generator you know. in this section. Once we get the robot taken care of, you should make sure it's all right. I'll get it. Every time, I try to breathe with it. It doesn't work. <laughs> okay. The main elevator to the next floor isn't working. But there's a maintenance elevator up ahead. Check your wrist map for details. To open it, press the holographic button on the back of your right hand. With settings? Oh. There we go. You can use the tablet to see mission objectives, status, and your location. I'm detecting something up ahead. There's a lot of them. Yeah. Stay alert. Keep moving. Head to the next door. Uh, okay, well, that wasn't creepy at all. Look for any clues to determine the code. I'll never guess it. How did I ever figure it out? Great security, 10 out of 10. Yaga. Yaga what? I understand what I meant. They're not really human anymore. 
Oh, Yaga joy. Move faster than you think. Watch out. Hey, Yaga. Yeah. This looks so cool. Uh, this game is pretty cool. Pretty awful. I'm picking up a lot of activity on the scanners. Probably more Yagas. Uh. There's a good chance you'll find the robot in the area, too. Yeah. Oh, automatic elevators, my favorite. This isn't gonna be sketchy at all. Going up. Yagas, don't let them get too close to you. Y yeah. I didn't think this was gonna be fun. <laughs> I figured the elevator would be a good idea. Off of my ride, motherfuckers. Good job. You made it look easy. <laughs> okay. When you find the robot, or when it finds you, try <laughs> to disable it by removing the batteries from its back. If you can't remove them, they should explode nicely. But we won't be able to repair it, and Citadel will take it out of your paycheck. One? How much Find am I getting paid? I'm detecting something big. Really big. I think it's the robot. Stay sharp. Is it a fucking gorilla? I didn't know it was that kind of robot. Gorillas terrify me. Get ready. Thank you. I'm saying right here. Um, I think she's starting to like me with my skills. Hi! Oh. Yeah, I thought that was gonna be the case. It might not see you as a threat. Then again, it might. Get out of there. How? Fuck you! The legs are its weak points. Give me the guns! Go! Oh, that's terrifying! Oh, he's gonna be. Uh oh. Okay. Come here, big fella. Just don't jump at me. Can I get away from this thing? I don't trust it. Head over to the generator. I'm worried that all these idiots might try to do something to it. Get moving. I'm that that's fucking terrifying. I'm so glad it didn't leap at me like it did on those things because I would have screamed like a little girl. I can't believe you eat those things. What rats? <laughs> You've obviously not been here long. You didn't hear any of that? Let's go. This would be so cool. I missed! Well, I got the guy with the left hand, so that was a surprise. You should have heard all of that. Unless you're just like, oh, monkey's killing more, and they can shoot now. Will you quit unreloading, you so? Okay, just had to check. Drop it! We can take him Damn it! Oh, you dick! Oh god! Yeah, yeah. 
Teleport! I'm already dead. Yeah, it didn't really give me a... Oh. Okay. Grab that, please. God damn, this guy's a champion. Do you, bitch. Did that one get it? Nope. Who's the other one? Oh. Whoa, mister. Kill, going back over here. Trust me, it's the first day of the job. Didn't really know what I was getting into. I had no idea where that was coming from. Pop it again. Quick quickest reload in the coldness. In the, uh, in the west, north, south, Antarctic. Arctic. We'll go with that. Nose edge. Pause. Uh, whoop. Go down here. Uh, my left hand is all off. You're dead. The power of teleportation, baby. Am I though? I have the high ground down again. Holy shit! You've got a shotgun. All right. Oh. Good shooting. I have some news. Good news is the generator room is up ahead. Bad news is it looks like a few of those assholes are already in there. Stay alert. You have to protect it from them. Well, I mean, I just destroyed that guy while I was running away. So, I mean, while I'm trying to flee for my life, I could murder the big guys. So, I mean, if as long as I'm trying, I'll be fine. All right. This game was, this game is actually a lot of fun. Dray and drop the base. Wah! Oh, damn it. Take two, that never happened. Drop the base. Wah, wah. That's not a gun. Hey, hey, hey. God, I put this gun sideways and it doesn't shoot because it unloads. You know what? Oh, 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 oh. oh, that was for me, I guess? Hey. Oh. I'll get you eventually. Hey. Mister. I just want to play a game. And it's called Men of the Faces of Everyone Who Shoots at Me. I'm, I'm really bad at this today. Shit, shit, shit. Is this safer? Ooh, who's eating lead? Who is eating lead now? Do it, do it. I dare you to do it, man. I dare you. Oh, you dare you, you fell for it. Let's go. What up? That's not where my hand's at. You better watch the language! Hurry up and get to the generator. We can't risk any more raiders getting into the hub. I ain't scared of no more raiders. These all, uh, oh. Oh, Hi! Going back up. Oh! I met up there!
the doors, then head back to the base. I've got some news about the robot, and it isn't good. Oh, okay, I'm gonna have to see how much I missed of that, because I just realized my f***ing audio wasn't working for whatever reason. But, uh, so yeah, there's Arctic, Arctica 1. Uh, episode 1, because I'm definitely gonna play more of this, because this was a lot of fun. Um, this game was a lot of fun, and I definitely look forward to it. I'm, I'm really happy I got the VR working. I'm just very upset that I don't trust anything recording-wise. I, th I don't know if next time, I don't know if I'm gonna do Vive for, the, for a while, because, uh, the, I bought... A thing that you guys will see if I uncrop it but it's this little thing right here and it's a it's a Vive controller stand it just slides down and it also charges now the thing is it's a magnetic charger which I was like oh that's cool so you got this little it's kind of looks like the phone it's got a little magnetic thing with like four little five little metal things where it touches and it charges you just plug it in and it mag magnetically charges your controller no problems ever but um I was having trouble with my with this controller. It wasn't getting picked up, and it wouldn't sync. And I realized that I had some uh, firmware updates. When I tried to update the controllers, it said plug them in. So when I tried to plug them in, I was like, wait, no, I got to get that magnet piece out. And it wouldn't come out. And this one's completely destroyed. Now, it's probably not going to focus because my camera is a webcam. But uh, you can basically get the idea that it's not what it's supposed to look like. And um, I don't know if I, that I don't think that's part of the controller, but I have to take out. I got to find the little star tool for these two to get open it up and try to like open up the, the controller and try to get it out that way. Um, but so right now I basically have no way to get that out. So I have no way to update the firmware for it or stuff like that. Uh, and it, if, if it is the controller, then I'll have no way to charge it and I'll have to buy a new controller, which is very unfortunate. But, Arctica 1. Really fun game. Like I said, this is definitely episode 1. If you see this, I'm sure you'll see most of it. Worst comes to worst, I'll just crop it and then replay some of it or something. I'll figure something out. But, um, it was a lot of fun. It was a beautiful game. I love that it's got a story and it's like a, it's made by like AAA titled people. So it's like, just the f like, yes, VR's doing it. But, uh, yeah, I had a lot of fun. I'll leave a link for this game down below. Um, I know it's not free. This game is 30 bucks, but uh, so far, I think it's worth it. I mean, I didn't have any frame issues. The game looked beautiful. Uh, the only thing that was weird about this game so far is the fact that I don't have free motion. I just have to basically, I only have the limited motion. But at the same time, like, in having free motion wouldn't allow me necessarily to teleport up to, like, the second balcony and stuff like that. And honestly, teleporting behind them and flanking them was pretty fun, so I'm I think I'm okay with that. I'll let I'll let the uh, movement aspect of the game slide, because it's still fun and worth it, and it's different, and I like that I'm not stuck in one location. I don't mind wave shooters as long as I'm not stuck in one spot and going like oh wave wave wave. No, I like story based going and then stuff like that. Like I'm okay with that style, but um, on that note, awesome game, and I will definitely be back. And as for the vibe, it'll happen when it happens. Um, I know you guys wanted me to play Steam Hammer, if I can get it on, I think I can get it on Steam, which will allow me to play it on Oculus, uh, and if that's the case, I will definitely continue it on Oculus, uh, but until I can get my controller figured out, I, I'm kind of screwed with my Vive, but at the same time, my friend Ryan has the Oculus, so if, whenever he's on, we can do co-op too, so, I don't know, but I thank you guys so much for watching, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I hope you guys, thanks.